Hey, what is up everyone? It's KB here and welcome to Kilobit. Today I'm here with the 5 best Chrome extensions. So without wasting our time, let's do this. So the first extension we have the iChrome, a fast productive home page. This extension is really great and useful because uh, you can have lots of widgets or sites in one place. So this is my setup. You can see here I have a quotes. I have a Facebook here, I have a news widget here, I have a top games widget here, I have a calculator, I have a YouTube, so on. You can add more widgets and you can also rearrange them however you like to arrange, okay? So you can see we have a weather, I just like to move it here. As you can see I moved it here and uh, if you want to rearrange, you can rearrange any widgets as you can see here. And you can also remove if you drag there as you can see. I can remove this like that and it's gone now so if you want to add more widgets or app just click on the man icon whatever you see there okay I think it's man icon and click on the widget okay and you can see we have a Google Analytics you can add that widget here uh, and you will see all of the widgets or site whatever you have added in one place so that's why it's really useful you can browse the Facebook while browsing the YouTube or maybe um, like you know uh, you can add the Twitter and Facebook in one place and you can browse uh, both of them at the same time so I have already added the Facebook there so I'm gonna add the Twitter if you want to add any widget any okay I'm just gonna add the Twitter for example okay uh, as you can see there are many widgets YouTube Twitter translate so I'm just gonna add the Twitter variable just select that and drag that here and then you have to log in with the Twitter account and you'll see all of the tweets here and uh, same for the Facebook you have to log in with your Facebook account and you'll see your uh, Facebook feeds everything in one place so this is really cool extension I will put a link in the description for this go there and get this and yeah let's head over to our next extension so the next one we have the unshortened dot link this extension is really helpful to unshort any shorted links so what I mean is uh, you may have seen lots of shorted links like uh, bitlay t.co uh, gwo.gl I use the Google to short my links so as you can see here I always short my links it's gwo.gl if you see these kind of things it's shorted okay it's not an actual website and you can't see that okay so uh, and uh, why this extension is useful because uh, like sometime behind these shorted links they are dangerous websites like they can show you pop-up ads maybe the website is not that you are looking for something like that so if you click on any shorted links after installing the extension uh, unshorten dot links okay if you uh, click on any shorted links uh, for example mine I'm gonna take my own shorted link because that's the easiest way to do it right now so I'm just gonna click on the shorted link and you can see here this was the shorted link okay this is my link and this is my site as you can see it shows the site before you visit that site okay and it also shows that this site looks safe so uh, obviously my site is safe so so on you can use this unshortened link to use uh, for like uh, bitlay add fly so yeah this extension is really useful i will put link in the description for this go there and get this and yeah let's head over to our next extension so the next one we have the quick search this extension is to do the quick search in different sites like uh, wikipedia google twitter amazon so first of all you have to install this and after that you also have to read this as you can see this one to know how it works okay and after that you are in any random site suppose okay here and I found some um, uh, product and I want to search it on Amazon directly so you just highlight that and after that alt a l t and a okay and it will search that in Amazon if you press the alt s it will search on Google okay if you press the alt W it will search on Wikipedia if you press the alt T it will search on Twitter the fastest way to search 
uh, anything on uh, Amazon, Google, Wikipedia or Twitter. So this extension is really useful. I will put link in the description for this. Go there and get this. And yeah, let's head over to our next extension. Next one, we have the better history. Uh, using this extension, you can browse your history better way. And uh, let me show you how it works. First of all, you have to install this. And after that, you will see the icon there of browse history. Click on that. And here you can see all of your histories, whatever you have browsed. Okay, so we can uh, see our history by day. Okay, so today this is what I have browsed. And yesterday, Saturday, Friday, so it goes on and on. Okay, so that's how you browse your history easy way. So this extension is also really useful if you want to see your uh, histories by day by day okay so after that we have a devices if you have login uh, using same account in another devices you can also see that and after that we have a search and after that we have a statistic here we can see what are the uh, most visited site today or uh, yesterday or this week okay or previous week average or all the time so you can also see which site i have used most using this okay so i will put link in the description for this extension go there and get this and yeah let's head over to our next extension next one we have the wot web of trust this extension will tell you if the site is trusted or not okay so how it works is uh, first of all you have to install this obviously and after that you just go in google and after that search like i want to search for best apps okay done and here we can see uh, if we see the this green icon in the end of the search as you can see here end of the title of the website as you can see green icons that means this website is trusted but if we see the gray icon not the green icon we see the gray icon that means that website is dangerous or that website is unpopular okay so most of the time this extension works only with the well-known sites so if your site is like uh, low ranked it might not work it won't be able to tell if the site is uh, safe to visit or you know it will tell you that uh, it, it is not rated not rated site let's say for example my site kilobit okay i'm gonna visit my site kilobit and after that we will see uh, this is my site and we can see the icon is uh, grayed out because this my site is low rank site as you can see security unknown it doesn't say dangerous that means it, this site is safe because uh, it is a low rank site it's my site <laughs> you know it's not too popular and reputation unknown that means this site is pretty safe uh, this is my site so I can say that it's safe okay so if you visit like any another site like youtube okay i'm gonna go and visit the youtube and after that i'm gonna uh, see there we have a green icon there okay it turned green so that means it's trusted maybe okay as you can see security safe and reputation it got the 4.5 stars okay out of five so uh, how many reviews as you can see this many people reviewed this site and my site no one reviewed because no one used this extension while visiting my site okay now i can rate this site if i want to like i have to sign up for if i want to do the uh, reviewing for the site so i don't want to do the review of my own site so i'm just gonna leave it there okay so i got the uh, this recorded my rating so it's my site so it doesn't matter maybe you guys will review my site and uh, do some really good comment after that maybe i will get the five out of five stars so yeah this extension will tell you all that kind of stuff if if the website is secure or not if the site is dangerous or not okay so uh, yeah as i said this site this extension will only work if the site is uh, well known you know like really popular or somewhat popular if the site is really low ranked just like me it won't work so i think that wraps up our list for today hope you enjoyed it if you did leave a like comment and subscribe and i will also put link in the description for all of these extensions to download you can go there and get them all and yeah i will see you in the next one take care of self and have fun bye bye